हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट दिस इज योर अनिल सर एंड यू आर ऑन द प्लेटफॉर्म ऑफ अनिल फिजिक्स गुरु इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी हाउ टू सॉल्व द न्यूमेरिकल विच इज बेस्ड अपॉन द रिफ्रेक्टिव इंडेक्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट अवर वीडियो डियर स्टूडेंट्स एज आई ऑलवेज सजेस्टेड यू दैट फॉर सॉल्व एनी न्यूमेरिकल यू हैव टू लर्न द formula of the given topic so in that case first formula is refractive index that is n is equal to c upon v where c is the speed of light in vacuum upon the speed of light in medium and one more formula 1 and 2 means refractive index of second medium with respect to first is equal to the refractive index of second upon refractive index of first and is also equal to the speed of light in medium first upon the speed of light in medium second and that is also equal to the snell's law that is sin i upon sin r so this is very important remember all this formula okay next is 1 and 2 means refractive index of second medium with respect to first is inversely proportional or reciprocal of the 2 and 1 means refractive index of first medium to the respect of second medium and the, the last formula is that is real depth apparent depth formula when the object is submerged in a liquid so a and w means ref, uh, refractive index of water with respect to air formula will be real depth upon apparent depth okay and the last is very useful data what is the speed of light it is 3 into 10 to power 8 meter per second so let's see the first numerical are you student dekhte hain first question jo ki aapke screen par hoga yahan par question diya hua hai ki a light ray is passing through water with the speed of 2.25 into 10 to power 8 meter per second okay if the speed of light that is c is equal to 3 into 10 to power 8 meter per second calculate the refractive index of water so coming to the point that what is given data so given data is speed of light in water to so, means v w is given that is 2.25 into 10 to power 8 meter per second and hence given is the speed of light that is c 3 into 10 to power 8 meter per second so what is the refractive index the refractive index is the ratio of speed of light in a um, uh, vacuum upon speed of light in a medium so speed of light and this means c upon v w placing the value what is the value of c 3 into 10 to power 8 meter per second upon what is the value of vw that is 2.25 into 10 to power 8 meter per second meter per second meter per second will be cancelled 10 to power 8 10 to power 8 will be cancelled when you solve 3 upon 2.25 or you can solve it by 300 upon 225 calculate the this this will be for 75 this will be 4 by 3 and after this you will find that this is 1.33 so refractive index of water will be 3.33 hence the formula and hence the solutions okay friends moving to the second question that is on the screen a light travels from a rarer medium 1 to a denser medium 2 the angle of incidence and refraction are 45 degree and 30 degree respectively calculate the refractive index of second medium with respect to first medium okay so what is the question this is the question look at here this is the normal as you know this is medium 1 this is medium 2 medium 1 is rare and medium 2 is denser when the light rays come its angle is 45 degree then it bends toward the normal after all this is the denser medium so it bends toward the normal so this is angle is 30 degree so what is saying that it saying that a light travels in a rare medium to the denser medium 
its incidence angle is 45 and refracted angle is 30 degree so calculate the refractive index of second with respect to first so what calculate karna hai? one and two you can say second ka refractive index with respect to first so, uh, you know the Snell's law what is the Snell's law dear students one and two that is equal to sine i upon sine r let's solve this and place the value one and two will be sine i sine i means incidence angle that is angle i and this is angle r incidence angle is 45 degree so you solve sine 45 degree okay upon sine r that is sine 30 degree how we will solve this we will solve as a place the value so one and two will be sine 45 will be one upon root 2 1 upon root under 2 upon sine 30 will be 1 by 2 as you know this 1 by 2 will be solved here like 2 upon root 2 so how we will solve this 2 upon root 2 it is uh, it is little bit uh, difficult to solve this so we will solve is at 2 upon root 2 into root 2 upon root 2 how will this is become this become as 2 into root 2 upon root 2 into root 2 that is 2 2 2 will be cancelled this will be root under 2 and what is the value of root under 2 that is 1.414 so this is the refractive index so what is the refractive index 1 and 2 will be 1.414 refractive index of second medium with respect to first is 1.41 hence our question is solved Dear students, you have solved the second question. Third question is depend upon that question also. And in this case, it is asking that what is the refractive index of first medium to the respect of second medium. It means that it is asking that 2 and 1. So what do you know? 2 and 1 will be 1 upon 1 and 2. Directly we will solve 1 and 2 ki value kya What is the value of 1 and 2? That is 1 upon root 2. So 1 upon root 2. So it will be 1 upon root 2. How we will solve it? 1 upon root 2. Root 2 upon root 2. Root 2 will be root 2 upon 2. So 1.414 upon 2. So you will see that 0 0.704 will be the answer. So what is this? 2 and 1. 2 and 1. Refractive index of first with respect to the second medium. Moving to the next question. The fourth question is on the screen that is a pond of depth 20 centimeter is filled with water of refractive index 4 by 3. Calculate the apparent depth of the tank when viewed normally. So, what is that a pond has 20 centimeter ki depth hai, usme water filled kar diya gaya, jiska refractive index hai 4 by 3. So, calculate the apparent depth of the tank when viewed normally. Jab usme normally dekha jata hai, to apparent depth uski kya dikhegi. So, given data hum likh lete dear students, according to the question, given is real depth, yani ki pond ki jo actual depth hai, real depth kya hai, to likh lenge real depth of pond. चलिए ले लेते हैं x लेते हैं x is 20 centimeter now refractive index of water is 4 by 3 तो we can say refractive index what will be a n w means refractive index of water with respect to air that is 4 by 3 3 given now asking about apparent depth na apparent depth let take as a y so how we will calculate we know that apparent depth or the refractive index a and w is a way of real depth sorry uh, that is the real depth upon apparent depth So, A and W, value of A and W is given as real depth upon uh, apparent depth. So, we are asking about apparent depth, we will take this is X and this is Y. So, it will be easy. So, Y will be X upon A and W. Placing the value, what is the X? X is 
20 centimeter given what is the a and w a and w means refractive index of water with respect to air that is 4 by 3 when you solve it 20 into 3 upon 4 if my calculation is clear 4 goes to the 20 goes to the 5 times and this will be 5 into 3 this is 15 centimeter so this 15 centimeter is the apparent depth that is y so this 15 centimeter is the apparent depth moving to the next question the next question that is a refractive index of glass is 1.6 and the diamond is 2.4 calculate the refractive index of diamond with respect to the glass so the answer is samajha students given kya hai this is the fifth question given is refractive index of glass so it means that it is given that a and g a and g that is refractive index of glass with respect to water uh, with respect to air that is 1.6 and again given that the refractive index of diamond with respect to air is a n d diamond for d that is 2.4 okay calculate we have to calculate the refractive index of diamond means refractive index of diamond with respect to the glass so as you know that d so means n d that will be a n g so a n d is given as 2.4 and a n g is given as 1.6 if my calculation is right it how many times it will be 3 by 2 and this is 1.5 so what is the refractive index of diamond g and d with respect to glass is 1.5 hence the answer in the same question if asked that what is the refractive index of glass with respect to diamond so what we have find we have respected that g and d means refractive index of diamond with respect to glass is 1.5 if asking that what is the d and g means refractive index of glass with respect to diamond so it will be reciprocal of g and d so 1 upon 1.5 that is equal to 0 0.67 so what will be d and g refractive index of glass with respect to, with respect to diamond is 0 0.67 so dear students these are very easy questions and you have to keep in mind that properly focus on the concept of the refractive index speed of light apparent depth etc so uh, is video mein itna hi hamare uh, channel ke sath bane rehne ke liye bahut bahut thanks aap logo ke support ki wajah se hum logo ne 500 viewers ko cross kar liya hai to hamari shuruaat bahut achhi chal rahi hai aap agar aapka isi tarah se support milta raha to hum jald hi 1000 subscribers ko bhi paar kar lenge so thank you so much for your support